were, you know, a small group of mostly Asian students. We kind of try and work together, invite our friends, which spreads awareness about Asian culture, and we just try our best to, you know, bring as many people as we can to um, show them how great we can, how great, we, how efficient, how effective our workings are. This one kind of incorporates all the Asian culture and all the different kinds of minorities, you know, in that area, showing that Asia is not just China or just you know Korea or Hong Kong. We're a big community that works together to, you know, promote um, different kinds of things and we just try to, you know, bring awareness to us. We were helping out the supply education group, which was, um, their, their goal is to build some schools in Lanana. We wanted to convey the message of giving grassroots transformation um, through education for the people in Lanana. I believe that we can all create change. We all have the ability to create change. And a lot of that comes from education. A lot of times we think education is just like books, it's just writing, but even fashion, that's education right there, knowing about fashion and really um, giving that gift of fashion and, and, and what you love and helping other students that, that don't have that same opportunity, that don't have that same chance that you did, uh, that don't have the ability to dream, but now giving that opportunity to them. And I think that's beautiful. The charities that we supported tonight was the Friends of Koya Foundation and also the Vietnamese American Scholarship Foundation who worked together to help um, gain initiatives to go to Vietnam. This year um, we are looking for more like, economic stability for impoverished families. Yeah, another thing that we like to see is young people taking action, right? And, and we've seen amazing creativity across the board from students from you know middle school, I mean just young kids to obviously undergraduate students that actually are using you know the university events and obviously trying to make an impact. Um, so it's again amazing to see people going down the catwalk, but somehow that's going to be related to slum education. I think in terms of my identity, you can dice it up in so many different ways. And uh, you know, I identify myself, myself as Asian American. I identify myself as Korean American, and you know, identify myself as American. Um, and none of those things negates the other, and none of those things are more important than the other for me. For being Asian, I mean, it, means, it means being part of a, a community um, that is uh, you know, that's still struggling to find its identity in America. That's often struggling. Uh, because someone else is trying to define our identity in America. Our people want to see, you know, relatable content created by people that are just like us, not some Asian actor that was told what to do by some Hollywood guy that knows nothing about Asian culture. Um, but being Asian American, I think, uh, is something I click to very strongly um, because I, I, I see us as uh, stronger in numbers than as individuals. It raises awareness, obviously, not just within the Asian community, but obviously throughout campus and throughout New York City where students can really get together and kind of come together for one similar cause once a year.